Welcome to Pathways of Hope. I am Lorna Campos. Today on the second Monday of May, as you look ahead to what's in store for you the week, is this a week of anxiety and dread, so many deadlines and concerns and sickness? Or is this a week of celebration, partying, celebrating milestones, small blessings and victories? Or is this a week to rest, sit back, relax, just be quiet? When I read today's gospel in John 15 verse 26 up to John 16 verse 4, it's kind of scary what Jesus was telling his disciples. What was up ahead for them? He said they would get thrown out of the synagogue. People who want to kill them will think they're doing good. It's a scary week. Jesus was clearly telling them a life of discipleship is persecution. It's um, if you want to do good, people will want to harm you. Hmm. Do good and people will want to harm you. Doesn't that sound familiar? You want to do good and then you get red tagged? So what's the good news? The good news is up there in John 15 verse 26, where Jesus says, I will send you an advocate. Jesus will send us an advocate. The gift and blessing of Easter for the season is resurrection, ascension, Pentecost. It's one whole story. When Jesus rose from the dead to free us from our sins, he says, wait, there's more. I'm not only being victorious over death. Wait, there's more. I am giving you my Holy Spirit, an advocate, an advocate who pleads your case, my spirit within you who will fight for you, that you may come to know me more, that you may be able to fight against sin. A helper, a comforter, a counselor. This is the Holy Spirit within us, giving us strength to face each day. So when we look ahead at the week, I invite you each day to pray, Come, Holy Spirit, be with me today. Give me strength and patience, presence of mind to face whatever lies in store for me. We want to say, come Holy Spirit, help. You know, when there are difficulties, shout out, help Spirit. I don't know what to say. And the Holy Spirit will empower us. Have you ever had the experience of saying, wow, were those my words speaking? Those words of wisdom where people say, thank you. I was so encouraged and refreshed. And we think to ourselves, I did think of that myself. That was the gift of the Holy Spirit giving us wisdom. And when we are at rest, let's breathe in the Holy Spirit and pray, breathe on me, breath of God, rest on me, holy dove. Come, Holy Spirit, come. So whatever lies ahead this day, this week, this month, know that the Holy Spirit is with us, the advocate in us to give us strength, and power. So God bless and have an empowered week.